Drifting your cars with the auto car driver is very easy. You just have to do some few tweaks to make it work. The drifting angle is controlled by the steering, so make sure that the tires are turning correctly. The auto car driver uses a speed brake map to define where the car will drift, so, the first thing you should do is visualize it. You can do that by enabling the show driveline and show speed map. Increase the brake simulation to extend the drifting duration. You can visualize the regions where the car will turn on the red sections of the driver line. Now you just have to increase the drift control to enable it, and control how much it will turn with the drift intensity. If the car is spinning, you will need to adjust the drift intensity and the steering until you get a more natural result. The auto car driver is a powerful tool not only for drift simulations, but to easily create any kind of car animations for your projects. You can keyframe the drift control to fine-tune how much the car will drift over time. The download link for the auto car driver is on the description. Get it now and revolutionize the way you create car animations for your projects. You can watch the smoke simulation tutorial to learn how to make your drifts even cooler by adding a smoke trail to the simulation.